So I want to make five suggestions about how you can deploy your arguments to, to best effect in a meeting. And I think the first and most important is that your force in a meeting, your strength, your capacity to impact, influence other people, it doesn't come from your arguments. It comes from the position you take. So before you start coming up with your arguments, give your position and then give the arguments that underpin that position. So give your position, I disagree with that, and offer to explain. So I disagree with that and I'm very happy to explain why I disagree. Or I think we should um, be increasing our prices by 10% in October and I'm very happy to explain why I hold that position. Number two, don't give any arguments before you've told the other person what it is that you're trying to achieve as a result of those arguments. Because how can somebody listen intelligently and analytically to your arguments unless they know what you're trying to do with them. So objective first and then the arguments. Uh, number three, no arguments before you've got a green light from the other person to get your arguments out. Because until the other person has given you permission to share your arguments, they won't be listening properly and they will, their, their mind will be producing counter arguments. Um, number four, one argument at a time. Never overestimate the other person's capacity to retain what you've said. An argument is much more powerful uh, on its own as a lone wolf than in a pack um, like, a, like a bunch of sheep. And lastly, an argument will only produce something when the other person reacts to it. So when you've given the, um, when you've given the other person an argument, make sure you ask them how they react to it because it's only when they react that the argument stands a chance of producing something.